Chapter 52 Wake up, wake up, O Zion! Clothe yourselves with strength. Put on your beautiful clothes, O holy city of Jerusalem, for unclean and godless people will no longer enter your gates. Rise from the dust, O Jerusalem. Remove the slave bands from your neck, O captive daughter of Zion. For this is what the Lord says. When I sold you into exile, I received no payment. Now I can redeem you without paying for you. This is what the Sovereign Lord says. Long ago my people went to live as resident foreigners in Egypt. Now they have been oppressed without cause by Assyria. And now what is this? asks the Lord. Why are my people enslaved again? Those who rule them shout in exultation. My name is being blasphemed all day long. But I will reveal my name to my people and they will come to know its power. Then at last they will recognize that it is I who speaks to them. How beautiful on the mountains are the feet of those who bring good news of peace and salvation, the news that the God of Israel reigns. The watchmen shout and sing with joy, for before their very eyes they see the Lord bringing his people home to Jerusalem. Let the ruins of Jerusalem break into joyful song, for the Lord has comforted his people. He has redeemed Jerusalem. The Lord will demonstrate his holy power before the eyes of all the nations. The ends of the earth will see the salvation of our God. Go now, leave your bonds and slavery, put Babylon behind you with everything it represents, for it is unclean to you. You are the Lord's holy people. Purify yourselves, you who carry home the vessels of the Lord. You will not leave in a hurry running for your lives, for the Lord will go ahead of you and the God of Israel will protect you from behind. See, my servant will prosper. He will be highly exalted. Many were amazed when they saw him, beaten and bloodied, so disfigured, one would scarcely know he was a person. And he will again startle many nations. Kings will stand speechless in his presence, for they will see what they had not previously been told about. They will understand what they had not heard about.